Pilgrim's Progress by John Bunyan, Part 1. The Sixth Stage, now when they were got almost quite out of this wilderness, faithful chanced to cast his eye back, and espied one coming after them, and he knew him. Oh! said faithful to his brother, who comes yonder. Then Christian looked, and said, It is my good friend Evangelist. I, and my good friend too, said faithful, for twas he that set me on the way to the gate. Now was Evangelist come up unto them, and thus saluted them. Evangelist, peace be with you, dearly beloved, and peace be to your helpers. Christian, welcome, welcome, my good Evangelist, the sight of thy countenance brings to my remembrance thy ancient kindness and unwearied labors for my eternal good. Faithful, and a thousand times welcome, said good faithful, thy company, O sweet Evangelist. How desirable is it to us poor pilgrims! Evangelist, then said Evangelist, how hath it fared with you, my friends, since the time of our last parting? What have you met with, and how have you behaved yourselves? Then Christian and Faithful told him of all things that had happened to them in the way, and how, and with what difficulty, they had arrived to that place. Right glad am I, said Evangelist. Not that you have met with trials, but that you have been victors, and for that you have, notwithstanding many weaknesses, continued in the way to this very day. I say, right glad am I of this thing, and that for mine own sake and yours, I have sowed, and you have reaped, and the day is coming, when both he that soweth, and they that reap, shall rejoice together, John 4 36, that is, if you hold out, for in due season ye shall reap if ye faint not. Galatians 6 9. The crown is before you, and it is an incorruptible one, so run that ye may obtain it. 1 Corinthians 9 24 to 27. Some there be that set out for this crown, and after they have gone far for it, another comes in and takes it from them, hold fast, therefore, that you have, let no man take your crown. Revelation 3 11. You are not yet out of the gunshot of the devil. You have not resisted unto blood, striving against sin. Let the kingdom be always before you, and believe steadfastly concerning the things that are invisible. Let nothing that is on this side the other world get within you. And, above all, look well to your own hearts and to the lusts thereof, for they are deceitful above all things, and desperately wicked. Set your faces like a flint, you have all power in heaven and earth on your side. Christian. Then Christian thanked him for his exhortations, but told him with all, that they would have him speak farther to them for their help the rest of the way, and the rather, for that they well knew that he was a prophet, and could tell them of things that might happen unto them, and also how they might resist and overcome them. To which request Faithful also consented. So Evangelist began as followeth.